I'm an emotional wreck. I love you. Please don't ever leave me. Can we make it work? I love you. One, two, three. Fuck it. Demi, welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're just joining us now, welcome! Oh my god, oh my god, have you seen the title? If you've seen the title, I hope you're feeling the excitement, I hope you're sharing the excitement with us. Today's video, we are going to be testing everything £5. Is it worth it? Are £5 clothes worth it? So if you haven't heard of everything £5, I'll be very surprised to be honest. It's basically a clothing website where everything is £5. Pretty self-explanatory. I have used everything £5 before. So when I was like, I would say in year 12, I went on and got some things and I remember particularly shoes. I loved the shoes from there because they were amazing quality. They looked really nice and they were a fiver. Five bloody pound, cheaper than a coffee these days. But I haven't actually used the website in quite a long time to be honest with you. And then they reached out to us via an email and asked if I wanted to work with them. And I was like, hell to the yes. Like, yes, please. Because I love bargains. As you know, my channel is kind of built on bargains. We love B&M, we love Poundland. And I was just like so excited for this video. As you know though, just because I'm working with them, that does not affect my opinion. If these clothes items or shoes or anything else that I got were rubbish, I'm going to tell you they're rubbish. Because I don't want you wasting your money, even though it is only £5. It's still your £5. So, for today's video, we are going to be doing a huge everything £5 haul. And I'm so excited. I just want to scream and shout and dance and have a party. Because everything is £5. Okay, we are going to start with shoes. Because like I said, I have bought shoes from the website before when I was younger and this is the first pair of shoes that I got so on the box it just says truffle collections kind of a casual everyday shoe but these are just a really thick soled burgundy shoe how bloody smart are these though look how bloody beautiful they look so they're like in this like suede burgundy colour and they are a purple which I love and I just don't have any shoes this colour and I thought they were quite a colour that you could wear with almost anything and I really like thick sole shoes at the minute it gives you a bit of height when you don't have it like me um, but yeah everything about these shoes is thick they seem really thick quality like I don't know if you can see but they are so thick they're stunning they're so soft and I just thought you know what for a fiver you can't bloody go wrong with them can you i actually really love them i think these would go gorgeous with like some mum jeans and a nice slouchy top like love that for me okay the next pair of shoes that i got also is from that truffle collection thing that we've got going on oh my god look at this it is a tortoise shell style pvc shoe who the hell is she I go out in town in these, no one would know these were a fiver. That is such a bloody bargain. It's cheaper than like Primark. Like you think Primark's the cheapest of the cheap, but then you have everything five pound, which is even cheaper. And you're just like, what? But these are so lush. So as you can see, they're like a um like open toe sandal heel. But look at that man. Look at it. And then you've got this bit here which you tie around your ankle to keep them on. And then you've got this. It's not like too big. I think it's like four inches maybe i'm not really good with sizes but it's not like too big it's definitely a walkable a walkable shoe but i love these they'd be perfect like if you have a really smart job in the office or on a night out is where i'll be wearing them um but i just think they're stunning and what i love about them is the coloring would go with any color you're wearing like there's not I, don't, I can't think of any colour that wouldn't go with these. Okay, so the next box of shoes I have actually come in this box, which says Lost Ink. Now, it was really interesting because when I was buying these on everything £5, it actually came up with, like, a little sign thing saying that these were worth, like... I'm sure it was, like, over £50, these shoes. And then it was, like, obviously get them for £5. What the heck? How the hell can they sell shoes that are, like, over 50 quid for a fiver? Look at that, man. Actually, these actually match my cardigan and my nails. 
look so these are like court shoes they are stiletto court shoes look at that point i love a good point it's like if you're wearing these shoes you know what you want in life do you know what i mean that's that's what this shoe is if you're wearing these I know that you know what you want in life because they're just so small but what I really liked about them is instead of just having like a straight side they're actually like curved and it just looks fancy like oh I've never seen shoes like this before obviously I've seen like court shoes but not ones with this like fancy side bit going on but I'm obsessed with these and I think grey is such an in colour as well that like you know these are amazing but the grey goes with everything like every bloody thing you wear goes with grey and like look even my cardigan like these are stunning like this cardigan mum jeans there's an everyday outfit or if i want to be a bit more fancy whack a dress on off or trot to the town do you know what i mean oh, 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 oh. and i really like the side detailing of them they just look so pretty and stunning but yeah this is like my bargain of the year. Okay, the next things that I got are moving on to like clothes and other type of accessories. So I actually for the longest time had wanted a new handbag, like an everyday one, because the one I'm using at the minute is tiny and I can fit now in it. So I actually seen this on everything five pound and it's such a plain bag, but I just thought it would be good for like my everyday bag. So it's just plain black, but it does have this front pocket at the front. Yeah, so you could stick something in i don't know and then you do also have a pocket on the back as well look at that we'll love a bit of organization in a bag um and yeah if you like just straighten it out so this is the bag i think it's so so nice so you get these handles and the thing i like about these handles is they're a good length to like put it on your shoulder like that the longer strap as well so if you prefer a longer strap don't worry about it huns they've got you sorted um but yeah i just think it's a really lovely bag and for a fiver i mean um, but look inside it's quite roomy as well and it does have um some pockets so you've got like a pocket on this side and then you've got some like not pockets but you know them like little bits of fabric which you can put stuff in they're usually really good but yeah i just really like this bag i know it's quite plain but i kind of want a plain one for my everyday bag i don't want nothing too fancy so i got that but nobody is texting me i thought i had a friend Okay, the next thing I got is actually another bag. Now, I've seen this one and I was like, oh, you're fancy. Um, so, as you can see, it's kind of got these, like, cut-out holes on it. Like, it's not embroidered. It's just, like, holes cut out in different patterns. But I really liked it. Again, this bag is black and it has a zip on the back so you can store extra things. And on the inside, it's pretty similar to the big one. It has a zip pocket on this side and then just that little, like, extra material bit. But I really like this. So this one just has the long strap, um, which I actually really like on this type of bag. I feel like it's kind of, like, uh, like an evening meal type of bag. That's how where I would wear this, not necessarily my everyday one because I don't think I'd fit enough in it for my everyday bag. But I really like it. Isn't it pretty? I love this so i thought you know what i'm gonna pick this one up as well next things that i got i don't know what it is right and i don't know at this point i actually feel like there's a sock monster in my house because every time i buy new socks they come back out of the wash with either well they're never I, i'm never able to find the pair again like once they go in the wash i kind of know at that point that i'm not getting them back they just never ever come back i'm sure the washing machine bloody eats socks Anyway, I seen that they had some socks on everything £5 and they were a bloody great value, so I thought I would get some. So these ones here that I got are, um, like, different patterns, as you can see. So they come in, like, size 3 to 7, so they're, like, for every size, pretty much. Um, but, yeah, so you got one, two, three, four. You got nine pairs of socks for a fiver, but they're like really good ones as well, like loads of nice patterns, and I really, really like them. And like I said, I have an issue with socks going missing, so I thought, while I say these for such good value, I'm going to get them. I actually got another pack of socks as well, but I love these ones. So these ones are like, got rainbow prints on them. So the butterfly is actually just the label, but they've got like rainbow prints. Let's show you a pair. Look at them little trainer socks. But I love this rainbow thing. I don't know why, it just looks so bougie. It matches my intro and outro on this video. Ah! But yeah, I actually really love these. So you get, um, I think, nine packs as well. So you get white, black and grey of these ones, which I really, really like. 
so yeah and i've made myself some more sock bargain accessory bits that i got these i was buzzing to find so i don't know if you know me if you've been on my channel a while hello if you're new here how are you doing please subscribe but I love earrings like I wouldn't say I'm a jewelry person actually more recently I would say I was the only things I don't really wear is bracelets I don't know why I just never fancy putting a bracelet on but earrings and necklaces and rings I've always got them on but just not bracelets and I've seen these on everything five pound and I just had to get them as you can say I'm wearing like hoop gold earrings now and I love 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 earrings like this like I love unusual earrings or really big statement earrings so I picked these up which I think are stunning so they've got these gold hoops here which I kind of got like little dots all on them but then i've got these ones which are gold stars how bloody lush and then these ones which are like a smaller thicker hoop but they don't go right round they're like that's the back of them there so you can see they finish a fiver for three pairs of earrings who are you kidding and they're actually lush i love gold jewelry as well like i'm always in gold and i'm really excited about these star ones i think they're stunning the next thing i got right i love little purses i don't like a big purse because it just clutters me bag up and i seen this and i actually fell in love with it it kind of looks so bougie and designer to me like it actually looks unreal so this is i don't know if it's inspired by a certain brand but i just loved it it's like a brown purse but then it has this like beige well not beige like dark like light brown here and then this like v pattern all around it and then on the back it's got it as well and then on the inside oh <laughs> And then on the inside so you just got a little button bit here yeah? and then this is the inside so you've got a section for cards you've got your like id bit in there and then you can also put your money not like i ever have any money on us i'm terrible for carrying cash does anybody else just never ever have cash on them but then also on this bit here yeah, it's got a little zip so you can put your coin i thought this was such a bargain for five pound i honestly love it so yeah this is my new little purse and i'm a bit obsessed okay the next items that i got are all clothing items so the first thing that i have here now if you've seen any of my clothes hauls i often talk about how i have a problem with shirts i don't know what it well i do know what it is i have too much of a big chest and shirts don't look me but i really love the look of a shirt visually so i seen these and i thought it might actually solve my problems these are like shirts with jumpers and I just thought these are look so, so smart with a shirt look. Because I feel like a shirt is so smart. So these are look so smart but actually not give us the people with the boob because they're not real shirts. So look at this. This is the black one as you can see. And then the buttons are like little diamonds. They're super, super cute. And then you also have the little shirt detailing on the cuff. And then it just comes down into the bottom. It's perfect if you want to like tuck it in or anything. So this is this one. I got it in black. So I actually got it in red as well. It looks like this it's like a really nice kind of maroony darker red again it's got the same type of front with the little diamond colors you have this and then yeah you can like tuck it in but i really love this um so i got these in a size 18 i got everything in a size 80 shirt jumper love this i think it gives you such like you've really made an effort smart vibes when really you've not made that much effort you've just put one thing on but layering things looks like you've made much more effort and this looks layered and i just think and i really like it and like i said it gives us that shirt look without the people so it's so good i think this was some like black jeans and them court shoes <sighs> who is she like oh my god i actually love this i really really love these things that i got are actually some jumpers because we're in that season aren't we we're still in the season of jumpers so i picked this one up which is in a gorgeous again red color <laughs> if you can't tell red's my favorite color but this is in that red color that i got the shirt one in but these actually have really fancy arms so the arms actually have like a ruffled tie on them so they like pull up i really like the style of these so this one is a v-neck so you could layer like a different t-shirt under it or a high neck t-shirt under it or you could wear it like a v-neck um and yeah this just comes down i really like the style of it i just think it's really really nice and again i liked it that much that i got it in black too because I, does anybody else do that i'm the type of person where if i like something and feel like i'm going to get a lot of wear out of it i like to have it in like multiple colors um but yeah i hope i like the fit of these because i got the exact same one in black 
it just looks like this but then it also has the ruffled arms and then it just comes down into a cute little jumper but i love it i'm still not over jumpers i'm still wearing them and i still love them. neck jumper i am obsessed now i have tied it up um to make it cropped because i just like things like that i think it looks flattering and i like the arms the arms are like really weird they like come down i don't know how to describe it but they're like i don't know they're just nice they're not basic they've got a bit more to them and i love things with a bit more to them nothing likes to be basic so these are like so cute but i really love this this is the style of the jumper so i actually got this one in red as well but i really like it and i like the v-neck i used to hate v-neck like i was one of them people that would be like ew why would you buy v-neck but i actually find v-neck quite flattering especially on my body type i think it's nice so You'll see me at the V-neck section. This thing that I got, I am so excited about. If you can't tell, I have this chunky knit cardigan on. This is actually from Primark. But I love, love, love chunky knit cardigans at the moment. They're just like, I just think they look so, so nice. And I often don't wear anything under them. I wear them tied up, kind of like a bit like a jumper. I seen this on everything £5 and I thought, whoa, that is so me. So this is a chunky knit cardigan in a beautiful red colour, like quite a bright red. But it has like little pearl type of buttons on it. I am obsessed with this jumper. Like I actually think it's stunning. Look at that. And I really like the arms on it. They're just like normal arms. And I feel like it's slightly cropped the jumper. It's not like going to have your belly sticking out. Because I don't want that. I don't want my rolls on show. But I feel like it is slightly cropped. So it's going to be really, really flattering. But I'm so excited to try this on. Like I actually love it. Oh my god. I can't deal i literally cannot comprehend how much i love this i like literally love this it's so nice looking it's like that knit jumper but i just think it looks lush and i love the fact that people are wearing cardigans without anything else at the minute because i personally think the style looks really nice this is like my favorite one i love the color of it i love the style of it i love the buttons i love you please don't ever leave me can we make it work I love you. Next clothing item that I got is actually a turtleneck jumper. It's in this really gorgeous rush colour and then it has some um, turtle buttons on the shoulders of it. And then it comes down and just gives you this little kind of three quarter arm. I really love this. Um, again, this isn't cropped. This is full length. But I really like the rust colour as well. I feel like it's a colour that's really in at the moment. And I just think this is such like a staple, you know, a pair of black jeans. If you want to just have a lazy outfit day, I think this could just look so nice. And I love ribbed material things. Like, I just think it looks so much better than plain. Like, fashion designers out there, if you're going to create something, please make it ribbed. I much prefer it. Thanks. Love, Demi. This is the Rust T-shirt. It's kind of like a jumper T-shirt. I absolutely love this. As you can see, I've just got it on with some, like, black joggers. But I really like the style of this. I think it's just so nice. And I love the high neck. You know, the thing is, is I don't like roll necks because they give you double chins. But, like, these with these T-shirts with a little bit of extra material, I really, really like because I just think they're really nice. And then I do have the Tortoise, 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 whatever they are buttons down which add a nice little bit of detailing onto this type of top usually i'm not about the extra detailing i like things quite basic but i do like this like like i said i love love cardigans at the minute and i keep seeing people wear cardigans kind of like tucked up or tucked into things like a cropped style but not like opening it kind of wearing it as their top instead of having a top underneath if that makes any sense whatsoever um and i decided just to get this plain black cardigan you can see it's just plain black it's got cute little buttons on it it's not cropped but you could like obviously fold it under if you wanted it to be cropped and then you've just got these really pretty arms on it but i just feel like i wanted a really thin jumper so i could style it like that and see if it's a style that i fall in love with or not but i'm really happy about this i love it so this is the cardigan i actually really like it and i really love this style of cardigan at the minute but i totally didn't comprehend that a cardigan tied up like this demi is going to be like a shirt and it's going to give us the peoples which it is giving us but i'm not mad at it i have kind of tucked it up to give me like a little crop like who am i but like you could pull it down and this is the cardigan um but i'm just annoyed about that little peephole but this this is my issue like big boobs do this to me all of the time with like shirt or anything like this like i have this issue but obviously this is still a really cute cardigan that i could wear and i probably would try and like wear it like that maybe if i just like stretch the material on the back it'll work um but i could wear it open as well as a little cardigan with like something cool but i really like it i love it okay the next thing i've seen now you're probably gonna think demi 
are you gonna wear that it's a little bit out there hon but I feel like I'm gonna wear it and I feel like it could be styled so nice so this is a coat a coat for a fiver I mean you just you just you just couldn't even imagine that could you um but this is a red coat it's in like this really smart i don't know what these are called like raincoat style coats and it's got some little buttons at the front and it's slight out is it peplum maybe i would class it as a bit peplum but i just love this i just thought it was so cute and i think it would look so so smart and for a five out i couldn't bloody resist okay so the coat definitely needs an iron but I love this. It's a little bit tight around like my shoulder area. But feeling that, look at this. I'd even wear it with this shirt and thingy underneath. A jumper shirt underneath. Like it looks like a proper office boss vibe. That's what I'm getting with this. I really like it. And I love the colour. It is kind of more like, I would say like a pinky red. But I really like it. Okay, the next two items that I got are actually off the men's section. As you have know, as you will know if you've watched any of my hauls, I love the men's section. Like in Primark, I go to the men's section because I love the jump ads and slogan t-shirts. And I just often find things that I like in the men's section. And I'm like, well, I'm going to have you, okay? Um, So this is actually from the men's section, but I love it. It is a red jump ad, but it's very sports looking. It's kind of like a razor. Like I'm going to be the girl version of Lewis Hamilton in this jump ad, okay? I just think it's really stunning. It's in this gorgeous red. You've got white detailing and black detailing down the arms giving it like a cute vibe and then you've also got that detailing carrying on in the jumper down the sides but I really like this so I got it in a 2xl because I wanted it to be oversized like I hope it's really oversized and loungy but yeah this is the first men thing I get I think it looks so nice and loungy and just like she's cool that's what I get from this jumper. I had it in a blue as well, but of course I got the red because red's my favourite colour. And it's really nice. You could also layer it with a turtleneck underneath if you really wanted to, but I like it like this. I just think it looks nice and like cute. If you watch my New York vlogs, you'll know that I'm really into fleeces recently. Um, and I've seen this one and I just had to get it. It's in this gorgeous burgundy colour. I got this in XL. Did I get it in an XL or a 2XL? No, I got this one in an XL. And it's in a gorgeous, like, red fleece colour. It's kind of got, like, a velvety look to it. I really like it. Then you've just got, like, your wide arms, which cuff at the bottom. And then it comes down. It's quite big, so I'm hoping it'll be, like, lush and snuggly. I bet you Sean's try tries to nick that off us. And I'll be like, hell no, honey. Get yourself on everything £5 and get your own. This is the men's fleece that I picked up. I really like this. It is slightly too big on us. I maybe should have got the large. But it does give us that kind of cosy vibe with the being too big. Um, and I really like it. I feel like I've seen some type of uniform though. Is it Sainsbury's uniforms? Like a navy, like a um, burgundy fleece. I've definitely seen a uniform that's a burgundy fleece. And it's reminding us of it. I can't think where it is though. But uh, nonetheless, I do really like it. And like I said, I'm obsessed with fleeces at the minute. I bought loads for New York and I just love them. I love how pretty hands are. What? It that's everything that i got all for a fiver i don't blame you if you can't comprehend it because i can't as well like i feel like the items are such amazing quality and like i just i just i can't get my head around it that's what i'm gonna say on that but yeah this was my testing everything five pounds haul i really hope that you enjoyed it if you would like to see more things or more hauls from everything five pound let us know by giving this video a thumbs up let's try and smash two thousand thumbs up on this video but yeah i really hope that you enjoyed this video subscribe down below and without further rat -a -tat -tat, i'll see you very shortly for another video bye <laughs>